Okay, example four. Here we have a particle that moves along the x-axis due to a force given by this expression. We're to find the change in momentum of the particle between zero and five seconds. Now this is a single particle and we're told it's being acted on. Um, remember, external force is the change in momentum with time. So um, the change in momentum is just force times dt. So to find the change in momentum, we integrate both sides. So this is just momentum. And this is the integral of f dt from 0 to 5 seconds. That's the momentum change that occurs in that um, time period. So what does this look like? Well, it's uh, 2.0t plus 3.0t squared dt. Again, our limits are 0 to 5. So... Um, I um, end up with here 2 times t squared over 2 plus <coughs> 3 t cubed over 3 evaluated between 0 and 5. So you end up with 150 kilogram meters per second or 150 Newton seconds.